Hey, what's going on guys? Saad here and in this tutorial, I'm gonna talk about the Lang attribute. So if you all want to a web, uh, have a website that you want to internationalize, this is the way you can do it. So first, know that it's not that simple, but yeah, you can, well, it's the one of the way you can do it. So first you need to do is here, so think about this. Um, uh, I think I need to remove all of that, yeah. And now uh, what I'm gonna do, I I'm gonna write a French word. Uh, just first, we need to specify the lang for, which literally means the French. Francius, if uh, uh, if you are familiar with French or if you are French, so ceci uh, est uh, un para uh, p. So this is the French word which means literally means this is a paragraph so we can see it's here and you can internationalize by that you know uh, it, that would be your JavaScript work of JavaScript engine to do to change your whenever your language is switched to English from French or French from German you know for German we have um, you know the Lang uh, in Ger the German we call Dutch, uh, Deutsch, so Deutschland, so Deutsch. Uh, we d I don't know who d Deutschland is, uh, but you know, uh, I can still type it something like. Um, uh, oh, let's forget about that. <laughs> That's a radical, radical, you know, talk. So, uh, um, so hope you guys understand. See you guys in the next tutorial.